Hi everyone, this is Paul Window. Welcome to the next day of your challenge where we are going to finalize our ad and we will be publish our first campaign. Remember one thing guys, you're just one step away to publish your campaign, right? I hope guys, yesterday you did the work, you did the task, you already create the ads or if you do not want to do that, you might find who that will be do for you, right? But end of the day you should have the image which you want to publish so in this video i'm going to show you the step one by one um how you can set up it and that will be good to go to run your first facebook campaign with the attractive ads keep two goal in your mind you need to be capture the customer attention and the get them click if you're on the screen guys you already create the ad set once you create the ad set that would be come to you bring to you on the ads where you need to create that that will be asked you this because i already have lots of ads i'm just going to continue simple way they will be uh, redirect me here so basically guys i'm creating i'm using my account which i usually use to run my business ads in the way I'm, i will be able to show you each and everything clearly if you are using your account of course that would be a new should be fine but here i'm going to use my one which i usually um uh so i want to usually use for my business account businesses uh in that way i will be show you more example right for here first when you will become here guys add name i have a strategy to give them a name of that why this one guys because whenever you have a, a lots of ads in a one ad group it will be easy to find it which one ads and uh, which ad format i'm going to use it right so here how you can give in a name of that c1 stand for guys creative one right if you have two then c2 if you have three then c3 right so like there we dot if that's an image put the image if that's a video put the video if that's a cross all put the cross all dot um which ad group you are going to um use the image for so i'm going to use i'm going to promote my one of my accounting course so i'm going to put this accounting because i have an ad group based on my accounting course so i put the accounting basically that show to me this ad is represent c1 and this is the image and, and this is for the accounting that what i'm trying to say to you right identify guys in the way they will be asked you which page you used to run the ad so i'm going to use my partner's name satinder's accounting training and in that way now facebook run the ads from this page instagram account you can connect the instagram account in the next video you will be i will be show you how you can connect your instagram account right so at the moment keep it simple do not need to worry about it we will be not going to publish in this video we'll be going to publish in the end of the video we'll be good to go but you need to be understand the foundation how we can do that ad setup guys in that way you are going to tell to the facebook what sort of ads you have or what you want basically facebook is this facebook have three options first option create ads that ads which you already created right you want to use that ad which you already used through the canva or the guy who make it for you existing post which means you already published the post on your page you want to use that post that what they are saying existing post or use a creative hub mocker facebook have a one tool where facebook allow you to create the ads and keep them safe in the later ads you can use it but we are not going to use that one keep it simple since this is the first but you can go and use it later on that will be really help one thing guys online marketing is an art you need to be play around it play with it you will be get a lots of things it's it's very interesting so go for a simple create ads now which format would you like to use so you have three formats on the starting single image or video if you are only single image or a video you can use it crusoe 
I will be show you what does it mean in the next video as I mentioned you you need to be at some cards every card represent um, their products or uh, if you have a variation of product or if that's that's highly highly recommend for the testimonials so the people will see a lots of testimonial in a one ad so I will be show you an example do not need to worry about it collection it's a group of the items where you have a lots of item it is a group Facebook making a group for it and people will easily get more information will be go through with it one by one but here in this video i will be going to show you only single image or a video because that's our goal to uh, run your first ads that will be really fun for you you can use later on uh, if you have a video if you have a cross all everything you can play around it and i will be give you some link that will be really helpful for you so i'm just like the single image ads and video ads full screen mobile experience this one is also guys and an instant experience basically that will be a small website facebook will create to you capture people attention instantly with the fast loading mobile optimization experience in that way people do not need to be redirected to your website they can get an information instantly when they click the ad so facebook will be um they will be asking some more information basically it's facebook have some more templates you need to be provide the all information when people will click they will be get the own information you do not need to be redirected to the or sent to the website right so then you do not need to be wait until your website loading so this is the another thing you can go through with it it's very fun for you add creative now this is the important thing where you will be add your image where you will be add your primary text where you will be add your all headlines where will be go through one by one there's a lot of things you need to be learn it from here so guys in the media right firstly you need to be add the image or video which would you like to run it if you are if you will have video you can use the videos here right if you have an image you can use the image since we are creating the image so we will be go select the image right so i'm going to cancel it here just for a minute i'll show you this one the creative video what does it mean guys which means Facebook will ask you some images, for example, two, three, four, five, ten images, more than that as well. Then Facebook automatically create a slideshow for you and then convert into the video MP4 format. And you can use that one as a video, right? So you can add some more images, more text on it. Facebook have um, that functionality. They will be making a video for you. You can use that by go through with it. It will be really fun, but I'm going to add just an image now the image you created you can upload it from your pc right or if you have some images in your account uh, you can fetch it from there as i believe so it's new uh, you might do not have but you should have on the page if you have page you already existing so you can fetch from the page as well you can fetch from the instagram as well you can fetch from the business image means your business manager have some images you can there's the common images and recommended images facebook have that functionality that will be recommend for you you can go through with this one by one but here i'm going to show you how you can upload we already uploaded a lots of images so as i'm going to run my counting i'm just going to select that one image guys yesterday as i mentioned you you should have a focus on the product the image the static image have focus on the product so here we are offering our zero industrial based training i put the name of it i put the image of the zero and it will be represented with the character that we will be show you how you can learn the zero you will be learn the zero through it right so original image guys you do not need to be crop it keep it original because facebook have a lots of options to crop you can do it but it's based on the image to image keep it simple and that will be optimized for you basically this optimize will be automatically adjust your creative when likely to be improved performance right so you do not need to be do anything if you want to be go for the low enhancement you can but should be keep it simple would be fine or you can click it will be a low for you and make a an performance for you right further guys what do you need to do is uh now your image is done you can see the preview here in that way 
you can see the preview um should be fine yep you can see the preview here on the instagram feed real story everything they will be show you um so you can view the more variations here um go through with it it's very fun facebook has lots of tools here um they will be sure to you how it will be look like when they will be publish your campaign right so go through with it will be really helpful for you this is the only preview where you will be see the old how it looks like right now the most important thing guys the primary text this is one of the important thing guys in the next video i will be show you how you can write the content for the primary text that content should be catchy i have a strategy about it how you can write the content that will be really helpful for you so in the next video i'm just leave it here because you need to be do it you can do it this video is for you but in the next video i will be show you how you can write the content what is the strategy behind it and how it will be help you to capture the customer attention and get them click right so i have a lot of strategy i will be show you in the next video i will be show you how you can write this all things and we will be um, on the way to run our first campaign i hope that will be helpful you're just play around it i'll give you the whole time play around it think what you can do what options you have do not worry about guys before publish we are not going to publish anything and facebook will not be show anything to uh, the customers all right uh, so play around it i leave on to you um, i hope that will be really helpful for you see you in the next video thank you